Okay guys, so I'm in the process of putting a windshield in this uh, 1975 Volkswagen bus. A uh, customer actually brought it in for some other stuff, but then when it was while they were here, they mentioned they wanted to uh, put a windshield in it as well. They had already ordered the American style rubber seal. Now what the American style seal is, is it has this trim that goes on it. Now if we come over here to the side, Here's this trim, and after a few years, it starts to get really crusty and just kind of gross looking. Um, basically, there's there's a couple different ways to do a windshield on one of these, and I figured I'd just do a short video here and talk about the different ways. Now, now here are the prices. This, these prices are according to West Coast Metric. Now, up on the top, we have the American style rubber. That's what we have here. It requires some sort of trim. Now this is plastic trim, and the thing that I just found out, I ordered a roll of this plastic trim, which is $29.95 a roll. Um, and it's actually about four inches, four or five inches too short. So the way this this would have this the way this came, the way the old windshield was, is this had one piece that went all the way around, and then there was a small chrome tab that just kind of covered the seam. Well, this new, this new uh, plastic trim is short. And so what you have to do is you have to put a metal tab here. You run the plastic around. You put another metal tab up top here. And then you run a second one around. So what that means is if you're going to use this plastic trim, you're actually going to be almost 60 bucks plus shipping um, to, to do your bus with this American style rubber. Now the rubber itself is $38 plus figure 60 bucks for the plastic trim. Or West Coast Metric makes their stainless trim right here for $21.95. Now I wasn't aware that the stainless was that inexpensive when I ordered this roll of plastic. Like I say, the customer brought this uh, molding in and I used the molding that they provided. It is a West Coast Metric molding. It's a great molding, um, high quality. Now, if you're not going for the original look, if you want something that's just easy to install and you don't have to mess around with any, any trim, you can go with the cow look style for $39.95. And basically, it's just going to be nice, smooth, black molding with no trim whatsoever. So, if you're getting ready to do a windshield in your bay window bus, keep in mind these these uh, these figures here um, the American style $38 if you go with the stainless it's another 21 for the stainless the plastic trim is ridiculous I wouldn't even recommend it because for 60 bucks you know you got to get two rolls and then you've got two seams you're, you're gonna end up with uh, the little chrome piece here and also up top and those eventually fall off and plus this plastic stuff you know like I showed you over here you know after a while it just it just looks looks horrible after just a year or two it starts to discolor and actually flake off the windshield for one of these buses is probably going to run a jobber um, about a hundred to hundred and twenty bucks but a lot of times the warehouses aren't stocking them and so they may end up paying some shipping to get it to you as well so those are some prices to keep in mind if you are changing a windshield on your bay window bus um, personally, if it was me, I like the cow look style. They're quick, they're easy, and you don't have to screw around with installing this trim afterwards. So anyways, just figured I'd share that with you guys real quick. Good luck with your windshield installations, and we'll talk to you guys later.